there we go. That's the end of the run. Oh man, that was tough. That was tough. Hey everyone, welcome back to the lockdown log. It's just past 6 a.m. The sun has not made it over the mountains yet. And today I'm doing a 15 mile long run here northeast of Buena Vista. We are going to be seeking beauty on County Road 371. I think you will enjoy some of the cool spots that this road has. I don't know how the legs will feel. Yesterday was another 30,000 step day, but we'll see how it goes. And hopefully halfway through, I can do a few tempo miles. This will be my last long run in this pair of the Fuel Cell Rebels. It's time to retire them, but enough of me talking. Let's get started with the run. How stylish are these gloves? They look good. Let's get started. Good morning, everyone. Todd Father here. We are north of Buena Vista. Beautiful morning. Temperatures in the upper 40s, low 50s. Gonna run north out and back on County Road 371 following the Arkansas River. Very beautiful route to run this morning. Some fun facts about Buena Vista this morning as we head into the third tunnel. Buena Vista, Buena Vista, we're not really sure. Different sources pronounce it different ways. Anyway, the area was settled in 1864 by farmers actually, who uh, thought that the abundance of water from the Arkansas River would make it easy to irrigate their crops and that this would be a good area of the state for agriculture. Now what's interesting about that is the city itself or this area only receives about 10 inches of rain a year. It's a very semi-arid climate. And so it's interesting that agriculture was a big draw given that it really doesn't rain all that often here. famous resident of Buena Vista. Track and field fans will all know Matt Hemingway, who Matt Hemingway, who won the silver medal in the 2004 Olympics in the high jump in Athens. <laughs> Nice. 
by mile at anaerobic threshold pace. We'll see how this goes. It'll be nice having the winds at my back. Anyways, let's start. How'd that feel? Felt pretty good. If only you could have seen the finish. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so how far into the run are you total? 11.68. Alright, so got a few miles, cool down, get to 15 miles, and we'll go back to the house and warm up. I'm a thousand miles from happiness. There we go. That's the end of the run. Oh man, that was tough. That was tough. Let's go back to the Airbnb and discuss the run because if I stay here, well, I already thorned myself on this bush right here. These thorns. Okay, so. Let's go back. The legs are barking. I would like to sit in the Arkansas River, but we just gotta get back to the Airbnb. Let's go. And I am back from the long run. 15.14 miles at 7.30 average. I will throw the splits up here and put the kilometer average right up here. So that was the longest run of the summer so far, as I'm trying to hit around 60 miles this week. So far, I'm at 55 through the first five days, and I am planning on taking Sunday off from running because that is the day that my family and I are planning on hiking Mount Elbert, Colorado's tallest mountain. We're gonna try to steal the FKT from Seth. Towards the middle of the run, I did three by one mile at tempo pace or anaerobic threshold pace. The first mile was 613, and then the second mile, 559. Third mile, 549. Felt good, that was a big confidence boost. So that brings us to the inquiry of the episode today. And this is going to be a different one. We are going to play two truths and a lie and if you have never played that before and you don't know what it is comment two true things about yourself and one false thing everybody else in the comments can guess each other's truths and their lie i will go first 
and you can guess in your head or in the comments, but here we go. One time back in May of 2019, I decided, you know what, I'm going to try to eat a whole jar of peanut butter. So I ate a whole jar of peanut butter. That is my first thing. Number two, my favorite city that I have ever visited is London, England, because I really like the football games or soccer. Lastly, my name, Parker. My name, Parker, actually is somewhat related to running. So I'll give you 10 seconds or so to guess which ones are true and which one is false. And nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. So the thing that is false is I have never eaten an entire jar of peanut butter in one sitting or in one day. I do want to sometime though. That is a big goal of mine. <laughs> Maybe sometime I can do the peanut butter mile. That would be awful. So that is all for today. I cannot wait to play two truths and a lie with you down in the comments. That'll be so much fun. But I hope you enjoyed today's video. I hope that you had a great run today. Live life to the max, run to the max. I will see you in the next video. Goodbye.